So today I'm going to talk about some of the seeds that we are harvesting here to have in our seed bank. Uh, we produce our own fresh food that we can supplement our diets with and you know if you have seeds you can potentially have plants and you can have fresh food all year round. So uh, here we've got dill, bloomsdale spinach, astro arugula and cilantro. So all these seeds were produced here, uh, harvested here and you know it's it's pretty easy each single seed produces its own plant hopefully uh, dill is dill is a really easy herb um, basically you just let it bolt you let it uh, flower and then you get these little seeds and you want to just let them sit until they turn brown and they dry out as much as possible then cut the plants down leave them for a couple weeks. So what I like to do is take these paper bags and once the seed is fully looking dried out and like the plant is dying, I cut it off and I stick it in one of these bags for a couple weeks. So it dries out and then I put it into a container, shake, shake the plant and then pull them off gently. So it's really all about thinking how it would happen in nature. You know, the plant runs its course, it produces seeds, they dry out, and then collecting those seeds and planting them. And if you're interested in what some of these look like, I've posted another video showing um, how these looked when, you know, just, just the other day, uh, how they're producing uh, in one of our planters. The arugula is really neat because it forms in little pods. You just let those pods dry out pop those pods open and then you have your seeds. So of course, uh, there's lots of videos out there on how to store these seeds. You really want them to be in a cool, dry place because the second that these seeds start getting too much moisture and they mold, they're no good. Um, but yeah, it's pretty easy. The, the best way to do it though is to be intuitive. Let that plant run its course. Uh, be gentle on the seeds when you're harvesting them and if you want a video of any of these in particular you can look it up or you can ask me and I'll make one about how each of these uh, types of seeds harvested.